I would like to thank all my family, friends, and fans for their love and support over this past week. But most importantly, I would like to thank Jesus Christ, who has been and will always be my best friend, my bodyguard, my teacher, and my almighty judge. Divine intervention led this amazing, beautiful, blonde, blue-eyed angel to my jail cell uh, I, I, through my daughter and a connection with her friend. And uh, I, just like I've always said, my daughter has a direct link to Jesus. He listens to her, he listens to her prayers. And she said when she heard about this, she felt chill. She knew she had to do something. And to my rescue, she came. And for the first time in 13 years, I have had real representation from an attorney at law. And I'll be honest, I haven't had a lot of faith in attorneys. I've went through 20 or so in the last 13 years, and I will never let you go. <laughs> uh, that came from the heart. I didn't write that. <laughs> Um, I want to also thank Senator Roger Wicker for his kind words about me in the press and for the record I have always felt that he is a good and an honest man. I respect President Obama. I love, um, love my country and would never do anything to pose a threat to him or any other U.S. official. This past week has been a nightmare for myself and my family. My mother has suffered as well as my children. I would like to get back to normal, which for me means being the best father that I can be to my children, supporting my favorite charity, Save a Life Foundation, and entertaining through my music. Thank you.